Mr. Twisty. Welcome back to Mr. Twisty's Storytime Adventures, where we meet for our weekly adventure. I love to read, share stories, tell really bad jokes, make balloon animals, and do magic. This show is meant to put all those things together, mix them up, and what comes out is Mr. Twisty's Storytime Adventures. I could tell you a joke about pizza, but you probably don't want to hear it. It's super cheesy. <laughs> want to hear a joke about paper? Ah, never mind. It's terrible. <laughs> I, get it. I could go on and on and on, but I have a show to do. This week, I get to share one of my favorite stories with you so we can go on a magical adventure to the land of fiction where anything is possible, like a machine that cleans up messy rooms. Oh, wouldn't that be awesome? Hey, why do basketball players have the messiest rooms? <laughs> because they dribble everywhere. <laughs> anyway, uh, welcome back to my treehouse, where we meet for each week's adventure. My treehouse isn't up high in a tree because, well, I'm afraid of heights. Some people think that makes it just a clubhouse, but I like to think of it as my treehouse on the ground. Each week, I get to share a story with you I hope you have never heard before, and hopefully one that you will absolutely love. Did you hear about the circus fire? Oh, it was intense. <laughs> intense, <laughs> intense. <laughs> oh my goodness, my jokes are bad, but boy, do I have a lot of them. What does a cloud wear under his raincoat? Thunderwear. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, hey, what do you get when you cross a hurricane with a little girl? <laughs> Today's story. Hurricane Shay by Lindsay DeSarbo Hogue. Hurricanes form early in the day. Good morning, Mommy, is what you wake up and say. The house is clean from the night before. Toys are in bins and clothes are in drawers. There is always a calm before the hurricane hits. I'll make you some waffles and ask you to sit. But hurricanes are unpredictable. They move as they want. Not waffles, you cry and demand a croissant. The wind starts to blow and the trees start to sway. You trudge to the bathroom and scream, Go away! But no matter when or where a hurricane brews, we stay close together and whisper, I love you. Your sister wakes up and you run to hug her. But the rain starts to fall as the clouds start to stir. Where are we going? You ask, since you are always on the go. To the store, to the beach, to the park I love so. It's raining, my dear. A hurricane is heading our way. But you don't understand that hurricanes won't stay. You don't want to get dressed. You don't want to stay in. You want to play in the rain and throw toys from their bin. But no matter when or where a hurricane brews, we stay close together and whisper, I love you. You decide to make a tent with blankets and a chair, still in our pajamas and syrup in your hair. Big Brother comes down to say good morning to all. The breeze is blowing so hard I think the trees all might fall. The hurricane is here, it's scary and dark, but you put your shoes on your feet, ready for the park. My love, we have to stay inside today. We have Legos and cars and games we can play. With your big blue eyes, you look right at me, ready to cry or yell or argue or plead. Instead, what you say reminds me of what makes you you. Toddlers and kids can be unpredictable, too. Mommy, I heard what you said before, and sometimes I'm crazy, but it's you I adore. No matter when or where a hurricane brews, we stay close together and whisper, I love you. The hard times are hard. 
Hurricanes are tough to sit through, but the good times are great, especially when I know I have you. And you know what we forget? When the room is a mess, the laundry's not done, Barry stained my dress, there is a beautiful rainbow after the rain and many clouds. There is so much to cherish and reasons we are proud. Whatever tomorrow brings or how early you wake up, no matter how many times you spill milk from your cup, no matter how tired I am, something will remain true. We will stay close together and whisper, I love you. The rain starts to soften and the sun starts to shine. The hurricane passed and we turned out just fine. Sometimes a hurricane might seem to last forever, but it's these times we can't get back we'll miss and treasure. Mr. Twisty's Storytime Adventure is brought to you by Birthday Buddy, the magical birthday countdown companion, like Elf on a Shelf, but making birthdays magical. For more information, visit mrtwisty.com. Oh, I love that story. Sometimes I feel like there's a rainbow coming after the storm. That makes both stormy feelings and stormy skies a little easier. That was fun to think about. What did you love about that story? Hey, want to hear some fun facts about hurricanes? Hurricanes, cyclones, and typhoons are all the same thing, but they have different names depending on where they are. The largest hurricane ever was named Typhoon Tip. I like to say that, it's fun. Typhoon Tip. It was so big, it was about half the size of the entire United States. Can you believe that? Hurricanes are the only weather events given human names. What's your name? I wonder if there's ever been a hurricane with your name. Hmm. I wonder if there's ever been a hurricane, Mr. Twisty. That would be silly. Since this story helped me see the rainbow at the end of every storm, I thought I would make a magical rainbow appear. And then I thought I could make a balloon rainbow to share with you today. Remember, my name is Mr. Twisty, and this has been Mr. Twisty's Storytime Adventures. Did you have fun? I certainly hope so. Please come back to my treehouse next week for another great Storytime Adventure. Mr. Twisty's Storytime Adventures. Mr. Twisty's Storytime Adventures. Mr. Twisty's Storytime Adventures. So much fun with Mr. Twisty. Yeah.